okay, right. This is very um, out of nowhere. Literally, uh, I was just, you know, getting ready to go to sleep. Well, no, I wasn't talking bollocks. I was sort of getting ready to go to sleep, kind of. I was, I was settling down. I was just about to record some Doom videos and stuff. And all of a sudden, Neil drops the chainsaw update. Bear in mind, about three hours before that, I ended up chucking 25k away um, for the giveaway. So, um, luckily... Uh, destroy. I can't remember. I don't know how to pronounce the name. Apparitions on on D on DF um, came through for me. Uh, I was being a complete cheapskate, <laughs> and he uh, he he went and bought me uh, a chainsaw and got a rare enhance on it. Um, it's level thirty. It's a Dilmar, which is quite funny that they did that. So I've never used one. I've never seen this in action. So I'm gonna equip one. Ooh, this is literally my first impression of this. Oh shit, fucking hell. So yeah, I thought I'd do a little... Okay. Um, it uses fuel. I don't know how fuel works with cars now, to be completely honest. I guess it sort of works by a gallon system. Okay, so apparently I've heard it's just like an SMG. And it does actually have its own... <laughs> Alright, okay. Alright, I see what we're dealing with. <laughs> I just fucking spat everywhere, what the fuck? Now, I have to be honest, because of how quickly these were implemented, I thought it was going to be a situation where you just swing it around and it would be like a melee weapon that's pretty strong. That would create a lot of aggro. I wasn't really expecting uh, it to be an actual chainsaw, just like Death Into 1. Go through, uh, go through stuff pretty quickly. This one's obviously got 32 body damage. I mean, I don't actually... Oh, okay. Body damage per hit is 2. Um, with the body damage. I don't know how much it is without it. I'd have to do the math on that. Um, that's that's ridiculous, actually, because I think an axe does about... Uh, actually, no. No, no, no. That's not ridiculous. I'm just talking shit. That's pretty decent, though. Um, attacks per second is 10. I'm trying to con compare it to an axe. If I go to my alt character, I have an axe on there. I want to have a look. Yeah, six damage per hit, and I barely do one attack per second. That is a crazy advantage. The problem, obviously, is that it's um, not amazingly economic, and it's going to create a lot of noise. Let's go Greywood, shall we? Or, or just somewhere. This would be good in an outpost attack. Crowd control. I want to test it in an actual crowd. God, I've got so many videos to upload, by the way. Like, I've got about three Doom videos in the pipeline. And then I had that giveaway video. I was going to have that out tomorrow. Like, there's such a... I'm so stocked up or stacked up right now just on videos to make. It's crazy. So this is another one to add to the pile. I guess this will be tomorrow's video. Am I anywhere near level 30? Oh, I'm in level 25 zone now. <laughs> okay, so how is this going to be on you dudes? Okay. Problem obviously is uh, anti uh, antibiotics uh, are going to be required. Uh, just just stuff in general because there's not a lot of knockback on this. That's his probably biggest downside, which was a thing in Death Frontier One as well. It wasn't much uh, in the way of knockback. It, it definitely stun locks them though. Like I can't see myself actually getting hit by them doing this. Oh fucking hell! Let's get the hell out of me. Yeah. I mean, do I think it would be good? Oh, that's a, that's a point. Bosses. Let's go to the level 10 area in a bit and I'll test it on bosses. Alright, please. Okay, I mean, it kind of works, but it doesn't really stun them, obviously, as, as you probably expect. This is taking entirely too long. There we go, thank you, right. 
see if I can deal with these assholes. Okay, I can't. That's the answer to that. Okay, so is it good for bosses? In in some respect. I think it'd be better just getting an SMG. Great against crowd. It's probably the best crowd control weapon, though. Because I can just literally do this. Like that. I, I can't wait to test this on an outpost attack. I think there's going to be one soon, so it'll be interesting to see what happens there. I might try it on solo. Either way, um, was this a good update? Yes. Is fuel going to be a overpriced soon? Probably. Um, what do I think? Chainsaws are OP as shit, and I love them. That's my verdict. I hope you all enjoyed.